Hey guys, just a little update uh, on the caravan. It's Friday the 19th of July. It's been cold down here, but you can see the sun is warming us up right now. What else is it warming up? Them solar panels. So let me show you through the solar panels that I've just uh, rigged up to a solar power generator. Um, and uh, say how, show you how it's plugged into the van. Ready? Okay, so you can see here the uh, solar panels, three times 80 watt solar panels, soaking up the sunshine. Soaking up the beautiful sunshine as she blows. Woo! So we're in the middle of winter, but these panels just leaning on the side of the caravan are doing great. When I install the caravan properly up the hill a little bit, then I will also install those solar panels onto the awning that will go on top of the, above the caravan. But for now, I've rigged the system, which is nice. Cable goes under the van and up into the under part of this chair. Just a couple of holes and then sneaks up the side here and there. As a solar generator, sweet as. So right now it is charging the Makita battery. So the first one is already fully charged. This is a second battery to go and charge. So the inverter is on, um, and the battery is a brand new battery from Battery Business. Um, John Godley, an amazing fellow, came and delivered it personally. His business, battery business, was a great find with so much information online about different batteries. So, um, if I zoom in, you can see the controller here. Change the mode, sort of lights it up. There we go, you can see it charging there. Um, but the power is also going out into the inverter and into charging the Makita battery. As you can hear whizzing behind me. I might turn that off. There we go. A bit quieter. Change that. 22 degrees in there. An alarm will sound if it gets too hot. And then there's this red cable here, which goes through the van and plugs into the outside of the van over that side and it goes into the inverter so that's DC 15 volt 12 volt to AC 240 volt isn't that great um, and that goes to power the lights and we haven't tested the fridge, but it should power the fridge. Depends on how good this battery, which is a AGM battery from Battery Business. Uh, so there's the power, solar power, all done, which is really cool, hey? So that's the Makita battery whizzing to life again. I reckon that's probably got about another half an hour in it and then it'll be charged. In. What's that beep from? Everything right over here guys? Yeah that sounds pretty good. Pretty stoked with that. Purchase. Very happy. So we are the next day and I'm pleased to say that the solar generator is working splendidly. The sun is out again, even though it predicted rain, and it is feeding quite a lot of power into this system. So that's a split of the batteries, hertz, amp hours. There we go, so that's how much power is coming from the solar panels into the battery right now. Now there's quite a lot going out, and it's definitely not from this 9 volt LED. What it is from is this Dometic fridge, which is only on 240 volt. And I've just turned on the power down here, can't really see. There we go, there's the power. Um, and we're gonna see 
if this goes cold in the next hour and if the battery handles a 240 volt fridge running off the inverter um, we'll do a test but I think I'll be getting a 12 volt fridge eventually let's see how everything goes <laughs> 